to explain another painting really fast that I have ready to go. Again, I'm just waiting to varnish it. And it, so far this year, and I know this year has just started, but it's my favorite painting so far. I just, there's something about getting the perfect blue on porcelain. And it's kind of a transparent, dare I really say cobalt. It's not cobalt. It's that dark oppression blue. And it's just, it came out so me and with what I was trying to accomplish. I'm still not exactly sure about my background color, but, and I would have made my grapes just a little bit more luminous, but I still, you know, you get to that point in painting and you're like, I'm not gonna paint anymore. It's, if I keep going, I might ruin it. It's so good <laughs> at that point. And it's very homey and it's very warm, but still cheerful and, I just, I, can, I don't know how to explain it. It's, you know, the a little blue cup in it has been a cup I've had around because I love the color in it. I, I think it's, it, and it's really cute. And that is the actual size that came here to a clementine orange. It's like a little, it's almost like a really cute little sugar bowl. And so it's something to keep sweets in, but there's nothing sweet in it. And I've got the fruit there, again, for prosperity, and um, I think prosperity is the best way of putting it. Blue is like royal blue, I mean, it's, but it is uh, oppression, closer to oppression, but the way it's um, sort of transparent on the cup, and I've kept, uh, of course, the transparent feeling of my painting because I really like that and being able to see the different layers and see the, the work and the reflections and how it reflects on my life. Um, I think that about covers it on this one, other than that, just it's by far, I think, as far as the still lights go and not the ones with roses and like my rose and bird one. I really like my roses and bird one, but it's a different kind of like. It's like I love it, but this one. I don't know how to explain it. There's just some pieces that turn out to be so much more you. And the bird and the rose ones is really me too. But it's like a different part of me. It's not, it's not like this one. I, it, uh, I don't know how to explain it. So the meaning, you know, in it, you do have the light in this one coming from above into the future. The, the one with the blue cup. It is, this one's definitely future oriented, where the other one was your wisdom comes from the past. This one is you're focused on the future. And it's so, it's a relaxing painting and cheerful. And I think that's why I really like it. I wasn't sure as we were, as I was working on it, how, how it was slowly coming about, and how it was slowly coming around. But when I was done, it was like, done! <laughs> Um, you just get to a point and you don't want to mess it up, you know, you don't want to go any further because you don't want to mess it up and it's, you just know you're, it's complete, you know, kind of like when I think God sometimes makes us and we're at the end of our spiritual path, it's time to pass on and continue our spiritual path in the next life um, or whatever your views are of that, it's finished for what it means. It's finished. It just can't get any better right now, you know? And maybe someday, if somebody else is painting something similar or whatever, they can improve upon it. But for right now, that, and as far as it being something of me, it's a really nice painting. I hope you really enjoy it, and I hope you enjoy watching it um, transpire. I don't know how much, again, I've got of it. I have to look through my clips to see what's usable, but just enjoy it and, and enjoy the painting. It's by far, it's, I believe, a, um, where did I hang it? Okay, it, it's an 11 by 14. Yeah, I think it's 11 by 14.
I put that somewhere else? Unless I put it somewhere else, that's its print size. Um, so it's gonna be, uh, I think $4.99, around $4.99, maybe a little bit more. It's just such a favorite piece, I really don't care if I tell it. So, I might ask more than that. I just do. That's one I would pass it to Carolyn. I, I like it that much. I don't know why, because you like the other works of mine that you think, oh, those are much better, or they might touch on your feelings a little bit more than this one does, because you know how you kind of have a preference. Um, for somebody's specific work, this one is one of those that I, yeah, I'm like, do you even want to sell it? Occasionally I do one like that, but I, I, I create it for other people, and I create things to sell, so, but still, it's one of those, it's, it's you know, so, anyway, enjoy.